In this video, we're going to take a look at membership levels for Paid Memberships Pro. Under the Memberships nav, there's Membership Levels. And here you can see that we have none. So let's add a new one. Before we do that, let's think about what we're going to add. Let's add a free membership level so that anyone who wants to can sign up and have access to something. And then let's have a $10 a month membership level, which will give them access to some certain categories so that we can put restricted content right into that category and very easily restrict access to it. So we'll call this first one free. And then we can create a description. And there's a nice WYSIWYG text editor so we can write in all kinds of things there. Let's just put in this level is free so everyone can enjoy. And then a confirmation message. This goes to someone who signs up. And here we have a little bit of billing details. There's initial payment. We're going to put in zero. And then we can check if this level has a recurring subscription payment, which ours does not. We can optionally disable new signups and have a membership expiration. So we could say we're only accepting free memberships this month. If we do that, then we can choose how many days from now this will expire. And then there are content settings. So we're going to say uncategorized category is available to free members. And now we will save this level. Now rather than click new, I'm actually going to click copy. And you can see that it actually does copy the original. So let's put in 10 MO. This level is for the more discerning amongst us. We'll just say welcome, enjoy our content. Initial payment $10. And this is recurring. So let's say that it is $10 per 30 days. And then there's a billing cycle limit. So we could put in per months. Now we could set this to go for a certain amount of time. Zero means that this will run on forever. If we put in 12, then it's for a year. And after a year, it will stop billing them and close their access. So I'm going to set mine at zero. You have the option to add a custom trial period. So we could say that it's $5 for the first three payments. So your first three months are half off. We can choose to disable new signups, which we don't want to do right now. And we can choose to set when membership access expires. As you can see, you can set it to a certain number of days, weeks, months, or years. I'm actually going to turn that off because I want people to stay signed up long term. Now this one also has access to uncategorized. So let's save this level. Let's go to posts, categories, and we'll create one called members. And then go back to memberships, membership levels. And let's edit 10 per month. Now this one has access to members. And there we are. Now we have two, free and $10 a month. In our next video, we'll take a look at users and the members list and how to get people into the right membership level.